What would you have me do? Fly into thermal current, ascend as high as you can, land on the landing point. Thermal currents will disappear. Four minutes? Four minutes is a lot of minutes. The literal, actual opposite. Okay. I think I see what the deal is here. Well, that's just an airplane. At what point in my flight training school do I get to fly, I don't know, an airplane? Because that seems like an important skill to have in pilot training. Might just be me. doesn't look closer than this, but. Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe that other one's lower than me. Is it like underneath? Eh, who cares? We're here now. All right, we're up to 450. And what even is higher than this? That one's not. That one is. That one for sure is. Don't know if I can make it there at this height, though. Pitch up into it. Will it grab me? Yeah! Rocket belts are a better way to travel than planes are for one person. Not gonna lie, game. Could honestly kind of care less about the, uh... About my, my speed decreasing at 600 meters. Especially in a situation where, like, my only method of gaining speed is to descend. Like, we'll be all right. Don't think I'm going to make this before time expires. But damn it if we don't, won't try. No! You said you'd take the currents away. Go oh. Well, only one thing left to do. Reckless endangerment. It's fine. Oh, 
I forgot I had photos. Still not entirely sure why we have photos. I think at that level of speed, there's a possibility the hang glider just like starts to break apart. Actually. Like, I feel fairly confident in saying they're not designed for that shit. Turn too soon. We got time. Make a good approach. Oh, hell yes. Let's go. Yeah. We're taking that one. Landing successful. Ano Give me another. Eight rings out of 15. So I guess this is about routing. Let's read the hand. I've not looked at any of these. Total of 15 rings. Score for each ring is the same. Look for thermal currents. Okay. Oh, I see how it is. I understand. We'll skip that one, thanks. Hey. Okay, didn't have great control on that one, that's okay. We hit one, so that's good. I'm gonna guess we're not getting a good time score on this one. I just got a hunch. That might be the that might be the major impediment here. Oh, you son of a... That totally should have worked. It's all right. I don't expect to score well on this one. I just want to get a lay of the land, see where the rings are. Get a sense of our, of our options. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. Bye, Goose! That's fine. Didn't want his stupid hang glider anyway. Oh God, that's gonna be too much, isn't it? Yeah! <laughs> okay, we're still good. It's fine. I know there's another one back there, I don't care.
Conceptually, I really dig this stage, actually. The whole idea being like, we put rings all around the stage. It's your job to figure out like what's the best route to go through and hit them. I like that. Yeah, this one looks good. Should be able to hit that. Then hit this one over. No, maybe this one. Can I hit both? Yeah, they're pretty close. It's unlikely. But pitch up. Yeah. Now, can we just dive and hit that? Oh, God, that's risky. Oh, God. Oh, geez. OK, I chickened out. I chickened out. That's OK. Still pretty good. I think it would have worked. I just pulled up too soon. There's a really there's some really high ones over there. See, this is a little tricky now because I'm going very slow and I'm very close to the ground and I don't like either of those things. Not ideal. Unless. Yeah, 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 yeah. What are we looking at here for time points? Like 10 out of 40 or something like that? If I, in fact, am even able to finish it in the first place. Which is still very much in doubt. Okay, there's the target. I was wondering where that was. There's one there. That leaves one more. That's a, that's, no, that's bad. the thermal you get in. Okay. This one over here gets you up higher. Probably should have... Maybe I should start over here. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if I can cut through from the river and go straight over to this thermal to get height to start with. Because this one seems like it brings you up high enough to hit all the other... At least some of the other ones. <laughs> sure, let's go for this one for some reason. Five minutes, we're getting no time points. None at all. What we really need is to get one, like, get up to a high point and just find a route that lets us just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then go. Obviously easier said than done, but I do really feel like that's that's what we that's what we need here.
I think I've got landing figured out. Okay, all the ring points. 10 time points is not bad, but it's not enough. Okay, we'll retry it. Now, can I... It looks like I can. It might be difficult to get over the trees, but this might actually end up being more efficient. Can't believe I got that, but very, very, very pleased with it. All right, now this one's here. This is good. I like this. Perfect. We'll hit this to get some height with the speed. Awesome. There's a high one over here that I think we can hit. Now that we've hit a bunch of high ones, we could relatively easily go for a few low ones without too much extra trouble. Like so. Though now we're down here. And I'm lower than everything. So we'll hit this thermal again. Hopefully, this is gonna be a little tight. Don't hit the don't hit the ledge. Don't hit the ledge. Okay, we're out of there. We're good. Don't hit that either. Okay, we hit that. That's good. Two more. Any chance we can hit? I know we can hit that one. That one's way too high. <sighs> okay. Still don't really have this routed perfectly, but this one should at least be better than last. Boy, when you get back to Rocket Belt, I hope they let me do more, uh... I hope they let me do more Rocket Belt League. That was super fun. That feels like a good one to get last. We're gonna have to hit this thermal again. Then kind of cut over. We're already at four minutes. Please. You know what? Fine. I won't crash her so we can use her again. Okay, so honestly, I feel like missing these ones in the canyon is kind of a huge detriment.
Blood Wolf absolutely correct on both counts. There we go. That's some good shit. Yeah, I think that, like, of all the tracks in this game, the hang glider music is the only one that I actually know from outside of the game. Like, as soon as it kicked in, I was like, oh shit, it's this music. And I haven't really done that with any of the other ones, even though there have been some good ones. I don't want to use the O word just yet, but this is looking more efficient, I would say. There's no way. Is there? Time for, time for some sharp angles. might crash now. Not really a whole lot of speed to do anything with. Boop. You're fine. That's fine. Drama queens, all of them. Wait, nope, not this. Not this one. Absolutely not. Okay. So we did learn something important here. And that is that we can't actually start with hitting these three in a row if we don't suck. But unfortunately, all right, good try, Hawk. It's time for Booba. Yeah, it does seem like there is a Mario Kart-esque, like, light, medium, heavy. I said that last time! Like, Hawk sounds like a creature. Yeah, this controls significantly differently. And not in a particularly welcome way. Wait. If we do in fact have a light, medium, heavy um, Mario Kart-esque like division of 
division of like skill sets, so to speak. Is the implication here just straight up that Robin is in the heavy division because tits? Because that seems like the implication. What's the justification for Rosalina? I mean, I would also accept the idea that, like, she's an adult. Oh, yeah, no, that... No, I mean, that makes sense. But I mean, like... They needed, like, a justification to make her the heavy character. And it's like, all right, you have the light... The light characters are straight-up children. The medium characters are kind of, like, tall but lanky. Like, Goose looks like a stick figure man. And then Hawk looks like a big, muscular bodybuilder. And then they were in the design room and they were like, all right, we need a female large character. What can we make large? Can we can we just make her like actually chunky? No, no, we can't go for that. What about can we can we give her muscles? No, absolutely not. What can we give the female character that would make her heavier? Giant boobs. Everyone will love it. And so they did. And they're like, this works great. Pilot Wings 64 needed more sex appeal. Obviously. This is not going well. Seven feet tall for Rosalina. Hey, that's fine. That works for me. She is like a... She is like the galactic goddess of, of like, stars and shit, so... She can be tall. You are, of course, correct. However, I would like to point out that she only has thick thighs in the sense that anyone in this game has thighs because most of them are just a polygon. Like a singular polygon intended to represent, like, both legs. All right, here we go. Damn. Yeah, still not great on the time points. We'll do it again. 
This time a slightly different approach. Literally. Fuck! That's fine. We got two. Maybe turn a little to the side. Maybe a little. Maybe don't hit that. Okay. Calculated. It was close, but do you know what my secret is? I don't like using this character, so I don't care if she dies. <laughs> 